Hey guys, welcome back. For the new viewers, my name's Sloby. I have a quick little video for you today. Um, it's fun day Sunday again, and we're gonna do a little cooking video. I'm gonna be using a cast iron skillet in the fireplace over here. What I'm gonna do is we're gonna have BLTs, bacon, lettuce, and tomato. And I'm gonna be cooking the bacon in the cast iron skillet, and then I'll probably chop up some tomatoes and just throw it in Italian dressing as a side. And I think my dad might be getting corn on the cob, I'm not sure yet. We'll see about that later, but all we're gonna do with that this time is just boil it. So, right now I'm gonna get the fire going, and then we'll take it from there. So I'm cheating, guys. I'm gonna use a blowtorch, and just throw it in the fire, and let that fire it up. I got some hickory on there, and I have, I'm having a little bill burning party. I got a bunch of bills I need to burn, so that's what I'm using to ignite the fire. It always makes me feel a little badass when I get the fire up the for a pain torch. smoky and then these bills are stacked in there so it's gonna take a minute I'm in no hurry it's Sunday all right guys so we got the fire rolling I just got done burning all them bills and now I'm gonna do a simple little side dish it's a pretty easy one we got the Tuscan house Italian dressing a couple tomatoes cucumber cutting board we're just gonna chop this stuff up put the Italian dressing on them And make a garden fresh side dish. So we're gonna keep it nice and easy. We're gonna start with the tomatoes. Some of them are beat up on the top, so I'm just gonna lop the top off. Also got a yellow tomato. They're less acidic. I like them a little better because I get a lot of mouth sores from acidy food. This is actually a pickle and cucumber. I prefer to use these. I like putting them in the fridge and I call them little crispers. You cut them up and when they're nice and cold, a little ranch, they taste delicious. This one overgrew, but it's still good. We like them. Good stuff. house Italian dressing. I really like this stuff. I like it in my salads, my cucumbers, my tomatoes. I don't like onions so I don't put the onions into this particular mixture. Keeping squirt. Try 
trying to be fancy. So check it out, guys. We got a super easy side dish for the BLT meal. Let me let me take you on a tour. So I'm not gonna garnish this stuff with anything. I'm a very simple person, a simpleton. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna just put this in the fridge and let it cool off, get the corn peeled, and then when we come back, you're gonna see the bacon. Maybe you'll be able to smell the bacon through the camera, hopefully. We'll see you there. The fire is just about ready. I'm about to break it down and then put the grill in there. There it is. Two pounds of bacon, Jimmy Dean. And a nice big cast iron skillet. We're gonna plop it all right in there and throw it in the fire. That'll make for a good Sunday meal. All right, so all we're gonna do is take this cast iron pan of bacon, two pounds, I know it seems like a lot, but we like leftovers in this house. And we're gonna put it in the flame. So it's nice and crispy. There it is, guys. Guys, if you can smell the bacon through the computer, please crush the like button, subscribe, hit that notification so you know when I'm uploading videos. So we got it so hot, we're just gonna keep it out like this. We crisp up some of that bacon good. Look at that, burnt. <laughs> Guys, comment below. Let me know if there's something you wanna see me cook. I like cooking outdoors, so keep it outdoors. Let me know. Guys, the bacon's all finished up. It beat the corn on the cob. So we're gonna get the table prepped. Look at that pile of bacon. 
and watch me burn my hands. Ready? Look at all that bacon. And grease. Mm. Cooking with Slovy, outdoor style. So we're gonna take a towel and we're gonna put it over the bacon. It's, clean, it's a clean towel. It's gonna soak up some of the grease and it's gonna cover it for the flies. We gotta get the tomatoes and cucumbers out and the corn on the cob should be finishing up anytime now. Maybe we'll even hook the dogs up with a little bacon juice, shine their coats up a little bit. They deserve to eat like kings too. So we decided to treat the dogs. Some of you will probably disagree with us, but we've done it with all our dogs, they love it. guys check it out we got our bacon we got our tomatoes we got the lettuce we got our little cucumber tomato salad got some corn on the cob our salt and pepper our breads are already dressed up got the salt and pepper here I brought out the old base seasoning because one of the things I like to do is put it on my corn on the cob so let's get a couple sandwiches made Bacon. Your lettuce. And tomato. And your tomato. I didn't put any salt or pepper on it yet, so just splash the salt on it. Both of them. A little splash of pepper. Guys, look at that, an American classic. A nice Sunday dinner. So what I'm gonna do is take a bite and give it a try. I gotta learn to take smaller bites when I'm on camera. There's nothing like bacon cooked on an open fire on a cast iron pan. It tastes delicious. Give this a try. It's an easy Sunday meal. Let's try yours here. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna go eat dinner, have ourselves a nice meal, and then we have the fire still going for a little s'mores later. And then uh, we're gonna call it a night. Got work in the morning. Thank you so much guys for supporting me. Thanks for watching the video. Comment below. Let me know what you think. And that was another Cooking with Sloby. Thanks so much for watching. 
I appreciate all your support. We'll see you next time.